Katie, thousands of cowboys and cowgirls rounded up today for a good cause, coming together for a roping benefit in honor of the 18-year-old shot and killed just before the new year. It's one element like the art of roping that brings a community together. Ricardo Ramos Jr. loved to rope and ride, and now the community wants to help out the family with their expenses. 18-year-old Ricardo Ramos Jr. was shot in the head two weeks ago. According to Cameron County Sheriff Lucio, it was Ramos's 13-year-old cousin that fired that fatal shot. I have three fathers. But the family and friends say they are not mourning his death. They are celebrating his life. This was his passion, and no words can describe how grateful we are. Thank you to everybody that donated, everybody that took their time. Thank you. It really means a lot. And this was his passion. There's no better family to be a part of than the team roping family. <laughs> I can say that from my heart. <laughs> this kid had a lot of talent. He was going to go far. And, uh, you know, he will never be forgotten. He will always be in our lives. Uh, you know, and again, we, we, uh, we're happy that everybody came out and joined. And all the sponsors, thank you so much for all your help. Mike Tejo says Ricky comes from generations of cowboys and remembers Ricky roping before he could even reach the stirrups. Ricky was a champion rider. Doves were released in Ricky's honor. The benefit included a live auction, silent auction, plates being sold, full concession stands, and a horseshoe removal stand. All the proceeds will be donated to the family. His passion for roping left his brand in this roping community. He won many championships, and the family says they are very grateful that the community came out and showed support. In the studio, Veronica Gallegos, Action 4 News.